2019, the year of endings. Besides Game of Thrones' epic conclusion Sunday, fan favorites Big Bang Theory and The Avengers ended, and soon Star Wars will follow. And for diehards, letting go isn't always easy. In fact, they've even got a name for it, Finale Depression. Check Twitter and countless have it, tweeting, the pain is real and it hurts. That grief over losing that person and that role in your life that you've been watching is real. Dan Reidenberg is the executive director for SAVE, Suicide Awareness Voices of Education. That word suicide may be a little strong in this case, he says, but depression and anxiety are things people can feel after losing a favorite show, grieving the loss of their favorite characters almost like they would the loss of a loved one. What people are seeing and how they're living their lives out in these series becomes part of their lives and when they lose that that is a tremendous loss to them. Getting this wrapped up in a show may seem like a stretch but Reidenberg says just think of the impact shows have on the way we talk, dress and even who we hang out with. You can even go back to friends and you can think of Rachel and her haircut. It literally became a phenomenon about how people cut their hair. He says for some people the connection is so strong it's hard to find ways to fill that time each week once the show is over. You either want to turn to uh, alcohol or you want to turn to gambling, you want to turn to some other kind of addiction. In those cases, he says it's important for loved ones to get them out of the house, back into the real world. Help them realize that it was a television show, their life is still here, and there's lots they can do with their life. Gordon Severson, CARE 11 News.